Hello viewers, thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing, thank you for liking, thank you for the tremendous work you are doing. Thank you very much and I can't stop thanking you for what you're doing. Yes, today it's another day with something new and something unique. Today's show, remember it's a show that brings you kids below the age of 15 to show us what different things they are they can cook. You may wonder why am I dressed like this? It's because today's show is unique and very special. Yes, as you can see, we are going to embrace our culture and that's why I'm, I'm dressed like this. On today's show, we have something different and somewhat different who will even surprise you on today's show. Remember what we are having this side. We are having our bananas. We are having our banana leaves. We are having our banana leaves stalks and our banana fiber. Bananas. We are so, so, so happy to have you on this show. You're welcome. And I am so yes. pleased to have you on this time. Okay. Have you been watching? Yeah. How is it? The previous so lessons you've been seeing, how are, how, are, how are they? The lessons we are so teaching. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's why you also said, you invite me, I'll show you what I have. Yeah. Okay, you're most welcome. Our viewers would like to know about you. What are your names, sir? I am by name of Sewu for Akram. Which class? I am all uh, senior three. And the school? The school is Saitina Abu Bakr. Anand. Yes. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi. <laughs> yes. Uh, Mr. Akram, we are here with Mr. Akram. He's going to prepare for us matoke or bananas. They are commonly known as matoke in Uganda, itoche in Rwanda, eritoche in Western Uganda, and echitoche in West in Western Tanzania. So Akram today. Is surprising us and proving it that even men can also cook. It's going to do the cooking and preparing of these matoke that are prepared in these banana leaves and they are going to be mashed. Uh, now we are trying to organize our banana leaves. But before putting our banana leaves, we first put our banana fibers in the half basket and then. We put our banana leaf up after putting the banana fibers after we put the banana leaf and then when we have finished so we are coming to prepare our food but this food the traditional food that we have to must it's a must that we must first eat peel it out and we are starting off with our peeling after we have finished to peel our matoke then the baganda they have something that they put after the food we have put in our banana fiber leaf then we are going to put something that is called kawuo in Uganda <laughs> in English it's hard to say but in, I know it's more in Uganda it's called the kawuo then we are cutting our kawuo then we put it on our food like this then after we cut the second one like this we put it this side usually made that they are put two on each side but see, uh, we have so little then we have put one to this side and one this side then after we have put our uwo, then we try to cover our food like this you first you you put you put this side first this 
side it's the first that is put after the food like this and then the second side is the other side after preparing our food Should prepare our food so well that it's so pleasing for someone to see it. We put our banana fibers which we had first put. When you find it that these things, these banana fibers have remained upside this this side up. You try to cut them short so that they can be easily. Yes, we are. So far, we are here on this step in Uganda. We call it Oksiba Emeli. But in English, we can say that we have finished to cover the food in our banana leaves. So, Akra, what next? What we are going to do next yes. is to put our banana leaf stalks in our prepared saucepan. Then after putting our water, but you should be very careful while putting our while putting this water. Then after we put our food. Then after putting our food, you have this half leaf of uh, banana. Mm -hmm. You make it one side like this. Then you put up here As we have told you earlier, it's a unique and a special show today. We are trying to embrace our culture, especially the African culture. Yes, today it is a typical way of preparing. We've been bringing you different shows, being in modern kitchens, but today we try to say, let's go back right to our culture, where it started from. We are here in the kitchen on our cooking stones, preparing our matoke. Matoke, they take to to one to two hours to get ready but when you're using this kind of thing we can take an hour to get ready and then after an hour they are going to be mashed so we are just waiting for our matoke and then we mash and enjoy matoke a staple food crop in uganda tanzania and other great lakes region there are many banana varieties in in the world but on today's show, we had the Highlands, the East African Highlands bananas, and they are believed to have originated in Uganda. In Uganda, there are uh, very many banana varieties. For example, there is Nachitembe, Mbide, Nakabululu, Musakala, and Impologoma.
The scientific name given to Matoke or Eritoshe is called Musa Achuminata. Matoke has got a variety and a number of important things. Matoke are used as food. For example, in Uganda, any traditional function you can go to, like that of Baganda over Nyakole and the Soga, you can't miss out the Matoke. The banana fields are used as animal feed to the cows, goats, and chickens. <laughs> We are now almost reaching there. Yes, right here we have our saucepan and Akram is going to show us the next step. Akram, now our saucepan is here. What is the next step? We are going to mash it. It's called Okunyiga and Mere. So, Akram Sawas, you know, and Okunyiga Mere. I told you that you will excuse me for today's show and I'll try to use Luganda because we are, we are embracing our culture today. So, Alimukunyiga and Mere Sawas, you know, Oluvanyuma, Atugabule. Then again, I'll see you next time. Okunyiga and Mere don't forget these are the rules. Oba we will know who we try to do. Come here, ya fe. Who will never do so? Chia sobolo kubula. We must go ako. Oko bika come here. Oblo unche esobole. Oko bwa we don't judge. Oko unya ka. O no must go bwa chia. O omulala. Ba muko zesa. Oko begin meri. Era muko zesa. Oko muko zesa. Oko begin meri. Ngo chia ko buli eri. Oko bika wa fe. Tu mani. Oko bwa plastic. Ni we muko bajaji ya fe. We ba kusanga. Na ba bika. No kugabule meri. Dear viewers, let the talking of the tongue with the teeth begin. Uh, matoke is one of the food that can be served with various kinds of sauces. But on today's show, we have prepared matoke with peanuts and it has been so delicious. But you can also be, you can also serve it with fish, beef, goat meat, beans, cow peas, vegetables, and others. Thank you for watching. Continue liking, continue subscribing. On today's song we have the word clonse. Clonse. C L O N E S E C S. What does it mean? These are the distinct groups of banana. Thank you.